Hey, what's going on guys? Matt here and welcome your faces back to a brand new video. Today I'm doing something a little different. It's not like a staff series, it's not a HCF Let's Play. It's just a little one-off commentary style video. You guys, if you're long-time subscribers, you will know that I love to do these videos. They're extremely fun for me. Now, instead of me doing like a regular commentary where I talk about a certain topic, it's actually going to be like a story type of thing. And the reason I'm doing this is because we are about 40 subscribers away from 1,000, which is really, really... I, I don't know the word. It's just really freaking exciting, and I'm really excited about hitting that milestone. I'm not entirely sure on what I'm going to be doing for a 1,000, so just comment down below if you have any suggestions. Uh, I'll probably just release a pack, but I'm still undecided. But yeah, the story I am going to be covering today is going to be my story on the YouTube platform, because obviously most of you guys are new subscribers. We've been growing extremely fast. I think we was on like... 800 subscribers a week and a half ago, which is like just insane um, So yeah, I'm just gonna be talking about my experience here on YouTube from start to right now present day Also, I apologize for my voice. I'm not feeling too well So if you do notice a bit of difference in it, that is why or if you notice lack of enthusiasm That is also why and one more thing before I do get into this story I am live streaming probably right after this video is uploaded So I will leave a link to that in the description if I am live uh, or you can just check my channel if I'm live you can come and chill We usually do have a few people who come in and chill with me. It's pretty fun uh, But yeah, just uh, come chill in the live streams if I'm live streaming it would be really nice to see you guys there Let's get into this video. Okay, we've been blabbering on for about two minutes straight now All right, so in this video I'm not going to hold back everything that's been like in my past on YouTube. I will bring it all up uh, I will answer questions that people have asked um, and I'll just go over everything from my perspective uh, we'll see, you know, how we'll just reminisce over exactly what happened uh, from start to finish to present day. Hopefully, you guys will uh, will uh, like it. I guess. So on the 25th of December 2013, I created my channel. Now the reason I actually created my channel was because on Christmas Day 2013, I got a brand new computer and that meant that I could record Minecraft in about 40 FPS. And I was like, oh my god, this is so cool because before that, my computer was so bad it could barely run about 20 FPS while recording. So I was like, I can't do YouTube with this. But when I got about 40 to 50 FPS, I was like, yeah, dude, this is so cool. I can actually record now, but I was wrong. So I continued to upload with getting like 40 FPS. Uh, I grew about 200 subscribers. Uh, that was all in the case of like four months. I got 200 subscribers. This was at the same time that painful PVP uh, was actually playing mine age and the Minecraft that like the videos I was actually uploading uh, they were mine age PvP videos and if you don't know what mine age PvP is it's basically just a vanilla faction server that was really popular back in the day and I uploaded on there I got about 200 subscribers and then I just disconnected from the mine age server I guess you could say I started exploring new things on my channel I started uploading different servers uh, I even created my own server at one point which I will get into towards the end of this video or towards the middle of the video I'm not sure where it'll fit in yeah I kept uploading after I got 200 subscribers I eventually got to about 380 subscribers I want to say and when I got to that point I was already playing Minecraft for about three years straight and I was just getting very, very tired. So bear in mind, this is from like 2011 uh, all the way to 2014. And I think mid-2014, I was like, all right, Minecraft is getting really boring now. I kind of just want to take a break. So I stopped uploading on my channel. Uh, and for the past year and a half that I was gone, all the people that were playing Minecraft when I was playing Minecraft, they just blew up. So when I came back to Minecraft, I was like, whoa, where's all these people gone? All my friends and they were all big YouTubers and I'm just here like, how, well, how could they forget about me, you know? But I mean, shit like that does happen, but there's nothing you can really do about it, I guess. But yeah, I returned to YouTube 2016 October. So bear in mind, I left mid-2014, so I was gone for a year and a half. Nearly two years, I guess you could say, but about a year and a half. Because I did return about July in 2016. I actually returned properly on October. And that's when I continued uploading. That's when I started to change up my content. I was not going to get anywhere in YouTube if I was continuing uploading the videos that I was uploading 
and those videos were videos like Sky Wars or Mini UHC on Hypixel. Uh, the reason I wasn't growing on those was because I barely put any effort into my videos. I had such a lack of enthusiasm in my voice, everyone just got bored when they watched my videos. So I figured I needed a change, I was like, okay, uh, MineAge worked out well for some people, I actually enjoyed the service so I figured I'm going to go back to MineAge, I'll start uploading there again, we'll see how it goes. And it went really well, I grew myself up to about 500 subscribers on there, bear in mind I was on 380. And then when I got to about 500 subscribers, people were getting bored of the whole Vanilla Factions experience. So yeah, that's when we got into HCF, and I got into HCF from this date, I got into it probably from November of 2016. So I've been playing HCF for almost half a year, pretty much half a year. And that's when I started uploading HCF, I started off slow, I didn't just, you know, overload my channel with a crap ton of HCF content, because I didn't want, like, you know, my, uh, my factions views, the regular factions, I didn't want them to just be like, oh, he's become a HCF YouTuber, I don't want to, yeah, screw that, bro, I don't want to deal with that, you know, go, go F yourself, bro. So, I uploaded, like, little videos by little videos, I uploaded HCF, like, two times a week and stuck to the Mine Age videos, and that went really well on my channel, I grew about 100 subscribers in a month, which I know, isn't good but for a small youtuber that is very good and now coming into the past three months of me being active here on youtube i grew all my myself all the way up to 960 subscribers which has is where i'm at right now pretty much i'm not sure let me just quickly check actually yeah we're on 959 subscribers so let's just quickly go over what happened uh, to get those other subscribers so I started to upload HCF very slowly, I didn't just bring it out, uh, and eventually as more people started to watch and more people started to enjoy it, I started bringing out more HCF videos, and a lot more people enjoyed it, a lot more people, I keep, I just realised how much I keep saying a lot more people, but it's the truth, a lot more people started enjoying my content, and that's what I wanted, I wanted to entertain people, and I still do want to entertain people, that's what I'm doing right now, I'm entertaining you guys. And if I'm not, then I don't even understand why you're watching this video, I guess. But, yeah. So the videos were doing really well, and I figured, alright, I'm gonna lack on the Mine Age PvP videos. And I am going to start uploading on Viper HCF, which is the first server that I ever played HCF on. And that's where my channel started to grow. I kept uploading HCF Let's Plays. I kept growing. In the two months that I was uploading HCF, I grew about 200 subscribers. Which, again, is not a lot of subscribers. But it's still a good amount for a small channel. Now, bear in mind, at this time, I was at about 800 subscribers. And this is only like a month ago now. Uh, and that's when I started to upload the staff series, and the staff series, which I've been uploading recently, that freaking blew my channel up, bro, okay? I went from 800 subscribers to about 959, which I just checked earlier on in the video, and that was all in less than a month, which is absolutely insane. And now we're only 40 subscribers away from 1,000, and all I have to say is a huge thank you, because my experience here on YouTube has been extraordinary. And honestly, I could not have done it without you guys. I think it's everyone's passion to achieve on YouTube. I think it's everyone's passion to be able to upload videos for a living. Uh, and I'm getting closer and closer to that goal every single day. That is exactly what I want to do, and I'm working my butt off to get it. Some people, they complain about not being successful on YouTube and stuff like that. And the reason they're not successful is because they don't want to be successful. If you're watching this and you're a small YouTuber and you want to succeed on YouTube, and I'm no way saying that I've succeeded on YouTube, but I've got a long way to go. But if you do want to succeed on YouTube, you have to be motivated. If you're not motivated and you're just uploading the videos to be famous, or just to get attention, it's not going to work out for you. I do this as a hobby as well as, I, I don't know how to explain it, I do this as a hobby as well as something I could consider a job because I put more effort into this than I do my actual work. Even though I don't get paid for doing YouTube, I still put a crap ton of effort into it and if you're going to be a small YouTuber, you don't want to put in that much effort. Bear in mind I put like four hours of effort into a video. This video alone will probably take me about two and a half hours to make in general. Then it's going to take an extra hour to upload probably. So yeah, I'm probably going to be live streaming after this video so if you guys want to come and chill that would be much appreciated. 
animated. And once again, if you have any suggestions for what you want me to do for a thousand subscribers, leave it in the comments down below because I really need some ideas. Uh, since it's Friday as well, I will likely be streaming until I hit a thousand. So uh, you may as well just come and check it out, I guess. I mean, what's the harm? You feel me? So yeah, if you did enjoy this video, please leave a like, that would be much appreciated. And if you stuck to the end of this video, I want you guys to go in the comments and I want you to type out your story on YouTube. Even if you've only got 30 subscribers, even if you've only got 1,000 subscribers, I want you to go in the comments, I want you to write your entire story because I want to read them. I want to see how you guys have been, you know, how you guys have went around YouTube. Your stories, your uh, experiences and how you've gone about things. It would be really unique and cool to see. And I'm not going to be a complete liar and say that I haven't run out of video ideas, but I've run out of video ideas. So if you do have any suggestions, please, please leave those in the comments as well. That would also be much appreciated. So yeah, I have made this video a long-ass video, but thank you guys ever so much for sticking to the end of it. You guys are the true homies. Now, I'm going to end this video here. Let's see if we can get 40 likes on this video. We probably won't because it's a little commentary one. We don't usually get as many views on these, but if you are watching this video and you usually don't leave a like, just leave a like for me. That would honestly motivate me a crap ton. Subscribe to the channel if you are new, and I will catch you guys in my next video or in my live stream, which I will do later. So, peace out, Girl Scout. Woo-woo.